This weekend marks daylight savings time and everybody's going to want to be in the sun, but you know what comes from sun exposure, freckles and sunspots. Both are brown spots that appear on the skin due to sun exposure and thankfully both are typically harmless. The biggest difference, age spots come from years of sun damage and freckles are a cute little genetic attribute. So how do we get them? First, let's talk freckles. These little flecks that form randomly across your face and shoulders are caused by an uneven distribution of melanin, the substance that gives your skin its pigment. When sunlight hits you, the melanin then reacts, making skin darkest where it's most heavily concentrated. The reason we don't all have this reaction is because genetics and skin type play a major role. People with light skin and light or red hair are more likely to become freckled. While freckles are totally harmless and often considered charming and appealing, I get that everyone who has them doesn't really want them. To prevent them from forming, sun protection is your best bet. Apply a broad spectrum SPF 45 or higher at least 20 minutes before you go outside. Age spots, also known as liver spots, are oval, gray, brown, or black splotches that appear on areas of the body that have been exposed to the sun the most. This usually includes places like the hands, the face, and the shoulders. Like freckles, these spots form when melanin is produced at a higher rate in concentrated areas of the skin, but it takes years of sun exposure before they show up. That that is why this condition is mostly found in people over 40. Age spots do exactly what their name implies. They make you look older. While lifelong sun protection can keep them from forming, are there treatments that can drastically fade them? Sure. One option is prescription bleaching creams like hydroquinone. When applied to the skin, these help gradually diminish spots caused by sun exposure. Laser treatments and freezing methods can also be used by your dermatologist to zap the extra pigment in your skin. Another choice is dermabrasion or chemical peels, which remove the top layer of skin, taking spots with it. Because these procedures are considered cosmetic, you will be paying out of the pocket no matter what option you choose. But if any freckle or spot looks like it's changed color or shape or size, have your doctor take a look at it to rule out any chance of skin cancer. I'm medical editor Dr. Corey Bear with your Weekend House Call.